Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So this channel, Everyday Data Science, is all about trying to learn the different concepts involved in data science by practicing a lot of questions. In this video, I am going to solve this question on lead code regarding convert date format and try to walk you through how we can develop solutions to such problems. Okay, so let's jump right in. We are given a table called days with one column and the data type being date. Day is the primary key for this table. We are asked to write a SQL query to convert each date in the days table into a string formatted as day name, comma, month name, space, day, comma, year. The order of the result doesn't matter. Let's go through this example. So this is the input table and basically we need to say what was the day on this particular date and then name month, day, year. Right. So if you see that is the output. OK, so let's jump right in and develop the query. Right. So from this table called days, we need to reformat the dates. Right. So we return the reformatted date and the function that we need to use here is date format. Which column do we need to format the date to so day and then the format now there is a long list of symbols that you know correspond to different formats right basically what they represent days months years day of the week time etc etc uh, i will put down a link which is a very extensive list of all those symbols uh, you can go through this you don't need to remember any of it, uh, but like it's just for your reference. So here we say the first thing is day name, right? So we write the format. So for day name, we need to enter ampersand W. Then a comma, since here we have a comma, then for month name, we enter ampersand capital M. Remember this needs to be capital like these are case sensitives if you you know do not follow the case sensitive part you are not going to get the appropriate result so capital w is day name capital m is month name and then a space for day we need lowercase e is stands for day then again comma and for year we need to put ampersand capital Y and in the output table, the name of the column is going to be day, right? So we alias it as day, right? So you see what we did from this table days, we are now using a function called date format, which is using uh, to, you know, format the date, the column that we need to format and the format. And this is how we do this. Let's run this and see what happens. So this is accepted. Uh, let me go ahead and submit it and see what happens and if it passes all the test cases. So yeah, this passes all the test cases and this is how we solve this. Let me know guys if this video was useful and I will see you guys in the next video.